show you guys how to get basically infinite obols and if you want to you can get infinite crafting materials uh with the exception of angel breath you won't be able to get that so it'll be infinite uh ways to get infinite obols and also you can also go for greater affix gear on any of the characters so you're going to see us constantly just click on the ptr boost and we're going to go back and forth now every single class will allow you to get one unique now it gives you basically the same thing every single time the sorceress will get the actual conduit every single time but you can look for greater affixes here and if you need them you can obviously just throw in this dash i'm only really doing this for obols right now but i'm showing you guys how to do it so on the ptr uh what you do is you just keep on making another character again and again i'm just renaming this one obol holder so i'm creating let's say if i wanted a specific druid uh unique like i wanted that brand new lightning one right so i'll just go ahead and finalize and i'll just create a character skip the campaign and all you need to do is talk to the ptr boost vendor you get a thousand obols every single time you get a bunch of different uh crafting materials you'll get uh you could technically get infinite gold this way because you can just sell the items although i'm like i said i'm just doing it for the obols but you can see we have now 2,225 obols. If I needed any greater affix gear, you get basically one of everything. So if you need to get a bunch of greater affix pieces of gear on a brand new character, this is not a bad idea at all. Like, actually, those, those gloves aren't bad for a build that I actually kind of want to mess with because I need armor. Uh, but uh, usually with uh, gloves, though, you do want all offensive. But if you needed to, you can go over here and you can see uh, you, you can sell it for gold, but... You can also get aspects. Okay, you can see how we have a little icon here. And what you can do, if you need to get aspects for any of the character classes, this is actually good too for aspects. This is really good, uh, actually. You just go here and you can see this aspect I don't have, so I just salvage everything. Boom. So this is the fastest way on the PTR to unlock everything for the most part. Uh, with the exception of like, if you need the Uber Uniques, you, you, as far as I'm aware of, you can't get an Uber Unique. But I, you can see I'm just copying and pasting this name, Obol Holder, because I'm literally just creating the character for... Uh, whatever thing now if I needed a, a, the rogue uh, Brand new item you can actually get the brand new unique. Uh, we're just gonna go finalize skip campaign and uh, Just start and you'll see that we're gonna be maxed out on obols in like just literally a few minutes here We we'll max on obols We can get greater affix pieces of gear for the rogue and it's the best way to gear up on the PTR It's kind of weird that they don't just give us all the new uniques when it's we only get a week to test But look at this guys. I just got a greater affix shred of Condoras, which is the brand new rogue unique This is the easiest way to gear up and maybe I needed a uh, brand new uh, Crossbow there that could be an option. Maybe I needed a dagger that was greater affix. Not that bad uh, Let's see what else we got here But this is a way that you can start to gear up your other characters a lot faster I like that that I actually do want to keep and then if I need to again get crafting materials or Since we have a lot of brand new aspects guys. This is the fastest way to get them so you can see I can just all items, boom, and then we'll unlock over on the left side. We just unlocked all these aspects. So at this point, I feel like it's going to be repetitive. That's all you need to do. Just keep on creating new characters and then just delete them when you're done. And then boom. And uh, once you're done, you just go on your other character because now, now we have maximum obols. You can only hold 2,500. So don't do this for like an hour and be like, whoa, I got, you know, all the obols. Where are they? Um, I'm doing this specifically because on the rogue, I am looking for a greater affix on specifically crit strike on a bow so instead of re-rolling a character every single time which still in theory you could maybe get like a really good crossbow or bow uh, but now i have all of these obols and then i just go to the obol vendor and i just get whatever i need now there's also another update however i've gambled like probably at this point maybe 50,000 obols because I've been doing this method, right? So you can get infinite obols, which basically allows you to get infinite items. You're supposed to be able to get uber uniques from this. Even if I uh, use my obols to get an item that isn't, like there's no uber unique bow, right? But if you were to get one, it's supposed to give it to you, but I haven't seen any of that. But you can see we've just got a greater affix, which is not the step we're looking for we're looking for specifically crit strike which i'm not going to be maybe that picky uh right now on the ptr but this is a way for you guys to get your gear get your aspects if you need any of these materials hey, it's a way to do it but that's how you can progress the fastest on the ptr that's getting all of the aspects uh for the most part you'll get most of the aspects and again just keep on rolling on the class if you need a rogue aspect don't be making barbarians again and again and again Every single class, though, will get a brand new unique. Now, it's not going to drop Umbacrux or any of the other ones. There's just one specific one that it drops for every character. I have no idea why they didn't just give us all the uniques, like, at a vendor or something, because we're limited on the testing. Uh, but nonetheless, that's how you can do it on the PTR to get 
fast progression on PTR, how to unlock a bunch of the uniques. And if you want like a greater affix one, like, like I just got that Shroud of Condoras literally on that. And I needed one of those to be greater affix on specifically that Dark Shroud. So do that again and again, you'll get, you'll, it's better than just farming in the open world is what I'm saying. But yeah, infinite obols as well.